inshallah, I would like to say uh, praises to Yahweh, Bashim Yahusha, and Bashim Khakadash, the brothers and apostles and elders, that great millstone, if you will. Peace and blessings to Sir Akim, doing his work throughout the four corners, doing his thing in true sincerity. Um, say, uh, Lord willing, it's edifying. Uh, just a quick lesson, real quick. On um, uh, that uh, event they had last night, um, uh, the Oscars were uh, Will Smith um, slapped um, this guy, uh, Chris Rock, and um, says, uh, says, uh, the Academy condemns the incident. Um, says, uh, yeah, because he told, basically told a joke or whatever, and, um, there's a whole, you know, scene on it and everything, so let's go, let's go to the images. Yep. All right, so, you know, pretty much I'm just going to get a few scriptures not gonna be too long <clears throat> you know so um i just want to do something real quick ritual because i did upload a video that said uh uh he's he's not a stranger to rituals so let me see yeah Nah, let me do this. Yes. We all know that famous picture where everybody has to cover their eye, you know. But anyways. Yeah, anyways. Um, so... Yeah, so this is this is one big distraction for the uh, masses of this of the world, and um, we um, you know pretty much you should know, already know that uh, you uh, have to take different oaths, you have to do um, different rituals and sacrifices to be even get on the big screen, you know, and and if you don't know, you you have a lot of homework to do. Um, you know, so there's 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 ample amount of evidence that that's true. And it's not just a you know conspiracy or whatever. You know. So yeah, um, that's that. And yeah, so you know his big break, I guess, was uh, Fresh Prince. Um, TV show, he has a lot of movies, Wild Wild West, um, other, other, um, hella, you know, he has hella movies, so he, he, you know, he ends up winning, ends up winning an Oscar at the end of the day, and, you know, all this, all this drama shit, so, I just want to get a few scriptures to make it be edifying. It says uh, Luke six. Yeah, let me get Luke six and twenty four. But woe unto you that are rich, for ye have received your consolation. Consolation just means a uh, prize, you know. It says woe unto you that are full, for ye shall hunger. Woe unto you that laugh that laugh now, for ye shall mourn and weep. All right. So these people that you see, they pretty much have their um, kingdom here on this side. And, um, you know, when they give their speech and things of that nature, they say, I want to give glory to God, first and foremost. <laughs> you know, um, those that are, are aware, you should know what God they're talking about and what God they worship. You know, it's not the God of the Bible, you know.
also, you know, these people have to do these type of acts and um, scenes to continue to have people watch their TV shows or to, to watch their programs because a lot of a lot of times now the ratings are uh, going down the drain. You know, the, the rating, no people are no longer watching it because they're no longer really interested. So they have to do some outlandish shit, you know. Um, <clears throat> along with like the NFL and NBA. This is uh, Isaiah 20, uh, oh, Salakia 52 and 3. For thus saith the Lord, ye have sold yourselves for naught, and ye shall be redeemed without money. So, you know, the, the saying is, you sold your soul. You know, there's, there's a casting couch that, that Hollywood has. And, and that's the initiation process. You know, that's the process that there's, there's times where um, a lot of these people's mothers, a lot of these people's family members come up dead, come up, um, uh, you know, car accidents and things of that nat uh, nature. Um, ultimately, those people had got them out, up out the way to continue to have this uh, 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 fame and fortune. Don't get me wrong, though, you know, the, the acting in itself, you know, it's, 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 it's entertainment, you know, it, it's, act, you know, everyone watches movies and things of that nature, but these people embody those roles and they have to have spirits that enter their body to keep these things up, you know, so ultimately, you know, they have a demonic possession, <clears throat> to do these things, you know, so, and you're seeing this man is an Israelite man, uh, uh, from the tribe of Judah, uh, slapping another Judite from the tribe of Judah, all right, so, that's another, that's what the, uh, the, uh, the, the elites showing too, that, you know, Jake is a beast is a violent beast and that agenda that they want to keep pushing and they get it they get these negroes to to play that out you know um, this is um uh the book of mark chapter 8 36 for what if a, a uh, for what shall it profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his 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 own soul, it's because uh, our Lord Yahushai was tempted by Satan to have all the kingdoms, and, you know. When he was fasting, he was tempted, and this guy is talking about how he was tempted by the devil. That God was testing him. All this crap, you know. That, you know, people, the average person was go, will eat this up and say, yeah, you know, that's true. But, you know, it's it's really a rig. It's all rigged. You know, it's a, pretty much a fake world. So, if you've seen the movie um, Truman Show, you know, I've seen that movie multiple, actually several times. One of my favorites. So, it's, it, it shows you how the reality the uh, Jim Carrey. He uh, he shows how um, or he and depicted in that movie how his reality was pretty much um staged. You know, and that he was in a simulation. <laughs> his reality was like a simulation. Like like scripted, you know. Matthew 24 and 38 for as in the days that uh, 
for as in the days that were before the flood, they were eating and drinking, marrying and giving into in marriage until the day that Noah entered into the ark. <clears throat> And knew not until the flood came and took them all away. So shall also the coming of the Son of Man be. So, you know, that we equate this scripture with uh, people living in a folly-like mindset where their distraction, their distractions is uh, at the forefront uh, of their prior their priorities you know this is um, this is like what pretty much drives them you know pop culture you know stuff like that um celebrity gossip you know um tabloids that you know um like um you know entertainment um um, I'm trying to think of a word. I'm trying to think of a uh, um, oh, bread and circuses, yeah, bread and circuses. You know, and this hat, this you know, th this has to happen for for this uh, society can to continue because if not, you would really see what. This world is really about, you know, and we know what's what it's really about. And you you can see all the antics that he's done in his past and all this. You know, you can go. It's pretty much it's on the it's on the internet. You can just go and see, because a lot of people like to give give outs to these individuals, like oh, they're human too, and all this shit, you know. Um, the Book of Mark thirteen twenty five, and the stars of heaven shall fall, and the powers that are in heaven shall be shaken. All right. <clears throat> So uh, yeah, the Heavenly Father has been taking a lot of these celebrities out recently. He's been he's been sending them back to the spirit world. And and what you're gonna see is a lot of these people's favorite celebrities being, you know, um, you know, the Lord requiring their souls. You know, and they're, you know, we're not affected at all when we see that, okay? A lot of these celebrities know that they're Israelites. I mean, like we've seen uh, recently with the antics of uh, Mike Tyson. You know, you know, you know, you're pretty positive. I'm pretty sure he knows he is, you know. So once you do know that, then you, you're required to have actions behind it, you know. So those stars of heaven are going to fall, you know, because that's what the leaders of our people. The leaders are not the prophets. The leaders are uh, these entertainers, or two thirds of our people, and that's not how it should be. But that's how it is, you know, so, um, Lord, what else was edified, we give all praises to you, Ahawah Bashim Yahushai, Bashim Rakar Kadash, the Lawrence of the Apostles and the Elders, that great millstone, rule well, Shalom.